He wants to be able to pay all his crew bonuses. We can go home with even less money than he showed up here with. How come he gets what he wants for his birthday? I wanted a Ferrari for mine. Did I get a Ferrari? No. Chad Green. Looking for a final round appearance over there. Primitive grind. The knives are made by Joe C. Maynard. That's why Joe is still down there. He's got a chance to put two cars in the final. So he's got just kind of a uh, casual relationship with Chad Green's machine. But he's got Ron Caps on the other side. Now, Chad had the better car in the last round. Find out if Dean Antonelli has made the right choices. I thought it was interesting hearing what Brian Karate said. Our goal was to not spin the tires down track. We accomplished that. I guarantee you that's exactly the same goal for that Napa Auto Parts. Gazoo Toyota. Don't spin the tires down the racetrack. Last time they did, drop holes and it slowed them down a little bit. Chad Green in the left side. Ron Caps in the right. Does the champ go to yet another final? Or does Chad get his first one? Three ninety nine beats four oh one by six thousandths of a second. Chad Green's going to the final round. Oh man, Ron Caps left first. He goes four oh one, and Chad Green was reeling him in and reeling him in. I'm not hundred percent sure watching that in live time. If Ron Caps didn't have the parachute come out, maybe just a split second early. We'll take another look at that in a minute. The margin of victory was six thousandths of a second, and there is going to be a jazzed. Dan Wilkerson on the starting line with Joe. Here with Daniel Wilkerson. You guys have finally punched your way into the final round. You got one more to go, but what about this moment? Uh, this is incredible. Uh, a lot of these guys on this car are young and they don't realize how hard this is. I've worked, I raced with guys for 15 years. I know that sounds stupid because I'm 35, but I raced with guys for 15, 20 years that wanted to get to this point right here. And uh, we got one more to go. We'll get him. You're 35? Punk. Wow, what a race. Watch this one one more time on the NHRA.TV replay. Ron Caps moved first. Both of them keeping the big old good years locked down on the concrete. Coming down into the finish line. Now, that finish line camera, I do believe, is at 1320, not at 1,000 feet. So I think that's why I saw. I thought I saw Ron Caps' parachutes come out first. But six thousandths of a second is the margin of victory. And Chad Green will run for a wine goblet.